Army cooks at Hawaii's Pohokaloa training area prepare to feed hundreds of soldiers their most important meal of the day. It's an early rise for this team. Cooking starts around 2 a.m. And the day isn't over when the food is ready to serve. These soldiers take hot meals into the training area's field ranges where Stryker Brigade soldiers are living. We push the meal out, load it up on a vehicle, they download it, and uh, they serve it out here in the field. And then uh, basically our role is just to make sure that everybody gets the right stuff. And then once the meal is complete, we load it back up and take it back to the rear and uh, do it again. The soldiers take both hot breakfast and hot dinner meals into the field for soldiers who spend their days and nights training. Trying to put out meals to these guys so they can come out here and do, get some good training, you know, get proficient on their weapon systems and their vehicles. And uh, without chow, they don't have energy. So without energy, they can't perform. Sergeant Evans already get food? To have like a, a nice hot meal really brings the morale up and then we get to eat all together. And we also eat with the other companies, which also you know, kind of cross feeds us. So um, we get to talk a little bit, break bread a little bit with each other and it really starts the day off all right. They're part of a brigade support battalion and field feeding is one of their main jobs on training missions like this one. The soldiers prepared more than 700 meals for each rotation. Tech Sergeant Michael Jackson, Pohokaloa Training Area, Hawaii.